Okay, so I'm gonna start off this beat by playing this chord progression right here. And we're gonna go over in a little bit exactly what I'm playing and every single sound I'm using. So stay tuned for that. So for this instrument, I'm using Sky Keys. This plugin is really dope. And I'm using this preset called About Time in the key section. I have a star next to it because I really like this one. So for the chord progression that we're gonna be playing, we're gonna start in the key of E flat. Just play these four keys right here. And the bass, we're gonna do a B. Octave right here. You don't have to do the octave, you can play the octave with the right hand. And this is a E flat minor seven slash nine over B. Now don't let that intimidate you because if you look at it and when you pause the video, it's actually not that hard to play. Then we're gonna go to a E flat. There's an E flat seven nine. And then we're gonna go to a D flat. Stay with the same hand, same keys in the right in the right hand. We could do this right here. I like the way this sounds better. And then we're gonna go to a B, back to a B. Okay, so let's record this in and I'm gonna leave the BPM at 130 cause it's like kind of like a slow. I think it sounds pretty good like this. I'm not gonna lie, let's just leave it at that for now. We can always come back and change something later, but we don't always have to like fix everything right away. You can fix as you're making the beat. So let's go ahead and EQ this a little bit. I'm just gonna leave some of this, reduce some of this high end. But I don't wanna muffle it up completely. Just, to, that's, just so it won't be so harsh. Yeah, there we go. Okay, so for my second instrument, like I said earlier, these beats, you kind of want to just use like those piano sounds, kind of those vintage E piano type of vibes. So for this one, I'm going to go to Keyscape and I'm going to use the Wash preset LA Custom C7 Wash sound. And it sounds like this. Now it sounds kind of deep right now, but I kind of want to keep it. I want to keep it at that deep level, deep tone, cause this is already very high pitch. So I'm going to go ahead and use similar chords. Obviously I have to stay in the same scale, but I'm going to play it a little bit different. Mm, brings that depth in. Very subtle, just super subtle. Mm, just go ahead and EQ the midsection just a little bit. And then this gets spread some of that low end just right here. Just distort a little bit, a little bit of noise. Too much noise right there. Mm. Okay, so for my third instrument, I was debating whether to do this right here. Check it out. It sounds pretty i know it does but then after that i was like okay it's either between that but then i found this lead here it sounds terrible well not terrible it sounds obnoxious check it out so what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna go for that lead first Let's just do a low pass, high pass. And some reverb. Let's add those little bells in now, right? Like, those are definitely working. I think they were also in the lead section, the shooting stars. That sounded crazy, bro. And 
and let's go ahead and add some reverb here, some effects. Beautiful. Okay, so the fourth thing I'm going to add, it has to be some vocal chops. That's that part that I want to keep. It's oh, it's like, it's love, it's love. Let's see, Baby, I came back to right my wrong. Okay, now let's go ahead and EQ the first one. Baby, I came back to right my wrong. Mm. Didn't mean to string you along. No, no, he didn't. Mm -mm. Some Bahala. Let's just use a regular compressor. We don't need nothing crazy. And let's go with the vintage VCA. And this is an echo delay. And this EQ it even more, a little more. Sheesh, what a process, but man, it's fun, right? Go ahead and add some drums now. Definitely gonna use a rim shot for rim shots. Let's go. Maybe this one can work. Hey, oh, I can hear it. Isn't it, man? Uh. I just want to add a kick already. Just, oof, just right off the back, the first one, not clipper. And I am affiliated with the not clipper. So if you want your drums to not, just click the link down in the description. Mm. Nice little bump bump. Hey. Uh. Now let's go with the three. Bum bum bum. Bum bum bum. Okay, let's go ahead and try to add some hi hats now. I like this billboard. Nice, it's just. See this bless hi hat. Hey. With the billboard one. I always go back to the same ones. What's wrong with me today? Oh my goodness. Now let's go for some open hats. Definitely this cry one. Love it. Ooh, it just fits the vibe so well. Let's just record this in. We gotta add like a little bell in there. I know which bell I got. I already found the bell that I wanna use. So, and it's called, you know. Ooh, here we go. So. I'm just gonna use it one time on the third, maybe the third. I could even bring this in like this and put it right here. for more percussion can i add that i could add this one my signature sound right here and the last thing but not the least is we gotta add the sub bass and i'm gonna go ahead and add the sub bass from trillion the one in my it's just my go-to's and it's called Big and Clicky 2. Alright, 
so now let's rearrange it and mix it up a bit because everything is like all over the place right now so let's hear the final result in three two one let's go bless those keys darling see All right, and we're at the deep end of this video. Let me know what you guys thought of the beat. Let me know if these videos are helping you guys out. We're almost at 4,000 subscribers, so thank you so much. And everyone in that comments, deep end. I appreciate you guys like a lot if you guys stay to the end. I don't know if you guys just skip to the end. <laughs> Say, let's hear the final beat. That's fine, I don't care. Like just pre I appreciate every single person that just comments deep end. And also uh, my rant of the day is if you want a MIDI chord pack or like a MIDI chord kit or whatever, let me know that's something that that'll be something good to for me to bring out. I don't think my chords are that great, but if any of you are interested in that, I'll be more than happy to give it away. Maybe one for free and then another one, like, you know, maybe a bigger one, just, you know, at an affordable price. So anyways, thank you guys so much. Um, till next time, guys, let me know what you guys want to see next. Stay blessed. Stay positive. God bless. And if you want to see more videos, just click on this next video right here. Peace out.